there's Tigre right there. Yeah. Let the guys know to put the lift over the side and stay anchored up. This will be an amazing way to end the trip. He's coming in on it. He's got it, Brett. He's got it. Yeah, he's got it right in the corner. Nice. Got the tag numbers. We've had so many fish that at this point we've run out of data sheets and our photocopier stopped working. So I'm just handwriting out a data sheet so that we get everything done on the lift that we need to. They're coming. Right now, I'm really happy with what's going on. His tail's still wagging good. Holy macaroni! We have a tiger shark and I'm off to the airport. I'm flying out and there's a tiger shark. Looks like it's swimming calmly. Hopefully they'll bring it in before I have to leave. I have 15 minutes left and we've ended this trip on the most marvelous way possible. This is amazing. Okay, Brad, I'm going in reverse. It's the first time we're going to see a tiger shark out of the water here in Galapagos, and it's also going to be the first one we tag in Galapagos. We time it so he's not here. We get all the credit. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. I got it, I got it, I got it. David's gonna do the thing, Kate Palaya's gonna do the surgery, and I'm just gonna freak out. <laughs> Total length. Right at nine feet. The shark looks really good. Everyone's just so excited about this. Hot blood. There's a lot of first going on right here with this tiger shark. We got the first blood draw in history in the Galapagos Islands in a tiger shark. The first internal tag in history that's going to allow us to track this shark around all the receivers that are here in the Galapagos Islands as well as the ones in the Revilla Gijedos, Mexico, and in Cocos. You got that other cow? Right surgery is done. Yeah, cool. This is part of our Eastern Tropical Pacific Connectivity Study. Nice yeah. job. That was like a two minute tag job. Okay, Bob. We're going to name this tiger shark Esperanza. Esperanza means hope. And it's hope that we have for the future of this park and the contribution our science will make to it and the people who live here. Amazing. This is fantastic for Galapagos, really. This is the top predator in this marine reserve, and, um, and this is the first one we've tagged here. Do your thing, girl. Oh, man. I was, <laughs> Never, ever quit. Always work to the end. Never give up! Let's turn it on you. Okay, he's eating it, he's eating it. Go, 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 go! Numero dos. Twice Okay, you can slow down a little bit. I'm going to name this beautiful female tiger shark, the second tiger shark on this expedition. A name that was selected by caterpillar Emma. Emma Darwin, the wife of Charles Darwin, explored this country in the 1800s and began the theory of evolution. Good luck, Emma. You got him? Yep. And we are now exploding the body of knowledge forward on tiger sharks in the Galapagos Islands. We've tagged three juvenile tiger sharks. Good luck, old girl! And we just had our first mature tiger shark move in on us in almost 20 plus days. It's in the water underneath the boat right now and we do not know what's gonna happen. Oh yeah, oh he's on it, he's on it, he's on it right now. You bit? Light it up there, we're on our way. Total length, 12 feet, 7 inches. Putting spot tag right now, so we're really close to finish this shark. Caterpillar names this shark Yolanda, after Yolanda Kakabatsi Navarro, president of the World Wildlife Fund and a woman who dedicated her life and career to the protection and awareness of the environment and environmental issues, not only in Ecuador, but worldwide. Fantastic. Uh -huh. Oh, you go, girl. Good luck, old girl. Woo! Woo! <laughs> this is going to be remembered, this project. When we download the data on the receivers, we'll think back to this day.